Let's get this little show started. It's a short one, but a sweet one. I appreciate you being here. Peace, world, peace. Welcome or welcome back. I am Goddess Dawn, the warrior baby, coming to you live from L.A. on this Monday, October 18th, 2021. Yeah. I'm here with a shot of love just for you. If this is your first time to a shot of love, it's just that, a shot of love. We all need it. My heart is full. I'm so thankful for the opportunity to speak to you today. Yeah, thankful to be alive and woke. Thankful to the most high and to the divine feminine within. Yeah. The breaths in my body. Thankful to the self and to the collective. The ones who are on the path of truth and ascension. Yep. Thankful for my tribe. For the love, light, and protection. They and thank you to you. If you're here listening, whether you're in the chat. Shout out to my warriors. I see you. 
whether you're in the bushes or in the deep flat. Yeah, I want to thank you. And now that that's been established, I want to talk to you about a couple things, starting with the reminder of who you truly are and of how powerful and magical you are. When you are in your knowing, yeah, we're talking about in your knowing, being in your knowing, moving past just believing and moving into the stage of knowing. You in your knowing, you're the most powerful weapon that you have. Yeah, the power is your birthright. It can't be taken or stolen, but it can be forgotten. Yeah, and that's why it's important to keep your daily awareness as your main priority. Yeah, daily awareness. It's achieved in the present. So you have to be in the present moment to appreciate and acknowledge the awareness. Your breaths, they're natural and they occur without thought, right? Even sometimes being taken for granted. But when you're mindful of your breaths, then you remember to express gratitude for them and for life in general. And then you remember to connect to the source in the midst of giving thanks. You connect to the source by way of the self. And when this connection is active, you become a high vibrating being. Yeah. When you raise your frequency, you are lit from within and able to attract other lit people, places, and circumstances. See how that goes? Whatever you emit, you attract. So when you're vibrating low, you attract low, low vibration people, places, and circumstances. But on the flip side, we're talking about being lit from within. Yeah. When I say lit, that means connected, activated, tapped into spirit. That connection from the inner self to the most high, you become one. And then as humans able to be guided without obstruction, without distraction. Our biggest obstacle to ascension, yeah, it's distraction. Comes in many forms. Of course, we have the media, film, television. Comes through people and our own self, which is the danger of not being connected. So when you're not connected, when you're not activated, when you're not tapped in, your light is off. And when your light is off, you can't see where you're going, nor can you be seen. And not being seen in the world is a low vibrational existence. You're below the radar, you're obscure, you're invisible. It's a life no one should be living. We all need and deserve visibility. We should all be shining. Yeah. Like I said, it's your birthright. God has the light bill covered. Unlimited use, free and clear. You have permission to turn on the light within and keep it on from now until forever. Yeah. You have permission to connect. You have permission to activate you have permission to the fuck in. Yes. You have permission to vibrate high. Yes. You have permission to go for yours and be seen. You have permission to twinkle, little star. Yes. As long as you're aware, mindful, day to day of your power, you know, your inner magic, then the world is your oyster. Or your bitch, if that makes it sink in a little deeper. Now, let's take some mindful breaths together before I go. Get comfy. Close your eyes. Take a nice deep breath. In through the nose and out through the mouth. One breath followed by the next. Mindfully, consciously. When you release the breath, really let it go. Feel your body really sink into it. 
Feel the release energetically and with every fiber. Now start taking a pause after you inhale. Hold your breath for a beat or two before releasing. Hold your breath for a beat or two or three before you release the next breath. There is power in that holding pattern. Embrace that when you can. Imagine now that the light within is filling you up from foot to crown, spilling out generously with every exhale. Yes, imagine pouring your light out into the world, sending love, light, protection, and healing energy to the collective. You can also imagine that the likeness of the individuals that you'd like to bless with this energy, with this light, with this divine energy in this moment. Imagine their faces, the ones that you love, ones that you care for, ones you want to protect, pour that light energy right on to them. Feel the gratitude for the awareness of this power, the ability to tap in at any given moment and be the magical being you were born to be. See the words thank you big and bold in your mind's eye. Feel the gratitude for life itself. Give yourself a big smile. Hug yourself so you know it's real. Yeah. I see you guys. Thank you for showing up. Beautiful spirit, Marcus, Ralph Wayne, Ronnie Lyles. Christy Power, yes, Karen J. Thank you for coming in, Neek 3T, yes. This awareness this moment in the present is very, very powerful. Embrace this moment. Make sure you're tapping in. Now go make it happen. Yep. Love yourself. Spread love too. Before you leave, like, share, subscribe, and comment if you're in the replay. If it's in your heart to donate, go ahead and do that too. The information is in the description box. Peace, love, and light to you, and have a blessed day. Spread the love, baby. <laughs> Till next time. <laughs>